There are scents that we made specifically for men. Our sign is for our company is called Scents for Gents. And we have a variety of candles that we sell to our clients. We have scents like Bonfire, scents like Zambuca, Orange Liqueur, Coffee, Leather. All on display here for you today. Roll high for a Sunday afternoon watching football. I mean, what guy want, doesn't want to burn a leather candle? It's fantastic. We're actually doing pretty good today. The top two selling candles that women have bought for us so far are Zambuca and orange liqueur. Absolutely. The leather, it depends on the type of woman that you have. She's into football, leather's burning Sunday afternoon. It depends. Senseforgents.com. Hello. What are you doing out here today besides making bubbles? Just blowing bubbles, having fun. Is this your booth here? Yes, it is. And what do you guys do? I sell magic creations for uh, friends of the fake, for fairies. Um, well, I'm an art major, and I was taking over my parents' basement. So I had to get rid of it somehow. This is Raku, it's a Japanese style of pottery. Yeah, I throw them on the wheel, or these are impressions of trees. And then when you put it in the kiln, you take it out red hot and let it burn in flames. And um, so it comes out. Wings, hands, little, little things to make it look good. Now, how did you get this job? What's going on here? <laughs> you must be getting paid an awful lot for doing this. Uh, I don't know, it's a great day. Maybe I might trade places with you. Anytime, anytime. Oh, you said that too quick. <laughs> oh. oh! Bobby Nicoletti! Good job! I used to be a picture. I thought you were a glass of water. What's going on? I'm selling my clothes. Do you design your own clothes? Yes, I do. My own clothing company. It's called High Voltage. I've been into fashion ever since I was very, very little, but I just started my clothing company about three months ago. Well, I see you're doing pretty good today. Yes, I, I'm doing very well. I couldn't help but notice you and your mom from across the way. Actually, your mom looks like your sister, so I wasn't oh, exactly please. sure. We're very fashionable people. Well, I love your glasses. Thank you. And the bubbles add some ambiance here. Yes. I'm here with Kings Park in the know. We're a Kings Park anti-drug task force, and um, we're trying to get the word out to the community. If you know something, say something. We have a toll-free number. It's actually, um, it's not toll-free, but it is a <laughs> local number. It's 273-1353, and it's, if you want to hit star 67 before you dial it, then it's anonymous. You can also get us at www.kpinthenow.org, and there should be information up on that website as well. Now that water bottle looks awfully cold today. <laughs> You cool it off? Very good. <laughs> All right. Be eating stuff. You're supposed to be selling stuff. What's going on here? I just finished my pickle. Well, <laughs> how did you get into pickle making or pickling in general? Long story. We have about two hours. I have a question for you. How can I grow one of these in my backyard, but just with hundred dollars instead? <laughs> That's a special seed. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta order that seed through us. I have. First, you gotta invest some money. <laughs> And then we'll give you a trick. <laughs>
anymore And I don't know what to say, don't know what to say. We're gonna find out anyway yeah, yeah. Well I'm so alone here Yeah I'm so alone Oh come on, oh come on and pick up that telephone and say yeah, I say yeah, I say yeah, you want me, yeah, you need me, yeah, I say yeah.